Hi, my name is Joram. I'm a core committer at Mattermost, and this is a plugin lightning starter guide. So let's get into it. Um, if you don't know what Mattermost plugins are, I suggest you go to developers.mattermost.com slash extend slash plugins to read about them. But basically, Mattermost uh, plugins are a powerful way to extend and deeply integrate with Mattermost that you can't do um, with regular integration points like webhooks um, and slash commands. Um, so if you want to read more about them, you can come here and, and take a look. Um, but we're going to get right into it. So we have two different uh, repositories to help you start um, writing plugins. The first one is the Mattermost plugin sample. Uh, this repository is the, the bare bones uh, template that you need to start writing a plugin. Um, so you can clone this and it's got everything you need. You basically all you have to do is follow the readme, uh, clone the repository, edit the plugin.json, which is the plugin manifest to um, be whatever you want. So change the ID, change the name, change the description of, to whatever your plugin is going to do. Um, run make, and then at the end, you're going to have a distributable tar file that you can upload to your Mattermost server, and you'll have a working plugin. Um, so that's the first uh, repository. I would suggest if you're familiar, already familiar with plugins, uh, this is a really good starting point because it, it just gives you all the, the setup and does all, takes all the annoying bits away, and everything's easy for you to, to start with. Um, if you're new to plugins, I would suggest looking at the second repository. This is the Mattermost plugin demo repository. Um, it's simil similar to the sample uh, plugin, except instead of just being bare bones, it has actual implementations for all the different plugin hooks um, and all many different of the uh, plugin web app components that can be overridden and extended. So um, I would take a look in here. If you're new to plugins, it's got a lot of really great examples. Um, if we look in the the server folder, there's got a great explanation of all the different things these server plugins can do. Um, and then if you go into the web app folder, it's the same thing for anything um, web app related. So um, what I can do is I can really quick show you um, how to get this up and running. So um, if you don't have anything already, what you the first thing you want to do is you're going to want to clone the one of these repositories, I'm going to do the Mattermost plugin demo repository. Um, oh, I'm not actually going to clone it because I already have it, but that's what you would do. You'd, you'd uh, clone that, then you would CD into it. What I'll do here is I'll open the plugin manifest file, the plugin.json. We can go into that. Um, we can make changes this to match our what we want our plugin to be. So instead of the demo plugin, let's just change this to be the starter plugin. Change the description. And that's all nice and done. So we've changed the ID. Um, now we can go and run make dist. So basically what this is, or we could just run make. Uh, what this is going to do is going to, to build both the server and web app sides of the plugin um, and create that distributable file for us that we can upload. So let's run that real quick. This will take a little longer to run the first time, but I've already run this before, so it's going to be a little quicker. And boom, it's done. So here at the bottom, you can see it's created us a plugin at under the disk folder. Um, so what we can do is we can switch to a Mattermost instance. Um, so it's, this is my demo uh, instance. So what you can do is you go, to, you go to the system console, you scroll down until you're under plugins, you click on management, and you can upload a plugin from there. Um, so you do that, you navigate to where your plugin demo is or your plugin distributable is, you upload that. And then look down here, we can see our we have our starter plugin. Um, you're gonna wanna enable it so that it's working. Um, you'll also see that in the sidebar, you also get a starter plugin uh, settings page if you have defined any settings in the plugin.json, which the demo plugin has two defined here. So you're seeing those here. Um, and then we can switch to uh, back to regular Mattermost and kind of see what this demo plugin's done. Um, so one of the things this demo plugin has done is create um, or is create another button here. So we can click on this button and it opens up a, 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 a root component that was added by the plugin. Um, just as part of the demo, you can see a couple other places that it's been adding things. Um, it's also created this demo plugin channel, which uh, is posting a bunch of things that the server is doing. Um, and if you want to see exactly what the demo plugin is doing, I suggest go looking at the code. It's really well documented. Um, and yeah, that's it. We basically have uh, a working plugin from nothing to 
something in just a couple minutes. So thanks very much. Um, and I hope you enjoy building plugins.